Margaret and today I'm bringing you a video sharing how I ship cufflinks. As you guys know, I sell a lot of men's accessories. I really enjoy selling them. One, because I can pick them up for relatively inexpensive. Two, I can store them very easily because they are small. And three, they sell for a pretty good profit. So I sold this pair of cufflinks yesterday and I am shipping them out in a bubble mailer, a padded bubble mailer. Now, I don't always ship my cufflinks out in a, in a bubble mailer. Um, these ones I feel comfortable doing that with because they don't have any stones or any bits that might get bumped off or broken off. So these I feel very confident shipping out in a mailer like this. Now, if it did have stones or pieces that I might think would break off, then I would ship them in a six by four by four box instead. Uh, so let me share with you how I do that. So I take the cufflinks and I have a handy dandy little velvet pouch. I have some smaller ones, but honestly right now, they are on top of my bookshelf, behind my pile of shame, and I could not get to them. So imagine this pouch, but a little bit smaller. <laughs> so they go in right in there, seal that up. Then, uh, because this is big, I will fold it over. Next, I will take the card that I have made to put into all of my packages, and this shares my Etsy and eBay shop, my email, and then on the back, there is a coupon code for my Etsy shop. So I take the pouch and my card, I wrap my card around the pouch so to sort of pad it, if someone were to feel around, like it wouldn't be exactly obvious what the object inside is. And I'll take this and slide it into my bubble mailer, like so. And then seal it up. Seal it up and it is ready, ready to ship. Again, if the cufflinks have a stone or maybe there's cufflinks and a tie tack, then they will ship out in a six by four by four box. Another thing I might also do is if the cufflinks are of um, very high value, such as gold or silver or things that have a much higher value that I would make sure to have um, priority mail on, I would definitely also ship them in a six by four by four box. Thanks so much for watching you guys. I hope you found this video helpful. If so, hit the like button down below, subscribe if you have not already, um, and then go out and enjoy yourselves guys, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.